Marco, I asked um, I asked Monty the same question. How's how's the team sort of responded and recovered after I guess a, a bit more late heartbreak in that Adelaide game? Actually, we're like personal wise and like what I saw everything the what we have passed just like a few games ago. Uh, I'm really like calm and you know like try to be like consistent in the way we're playing because I think we're playing really good football so far. So we just has been you know, lucky a little bit but in the end I think we're gonna have a payoff, you know, I think that is my feeling. And if we're still playing and, and believe in the in the process, uh, actually tomorrow is a very important day for us to like we have to win here at home to keep like being a uh, fighting for the our goal that is to be in the top six. So this is this is my main goal, and, and I think yeah, I'm still working on it. I think it's only part of the way. It's part of the process. Uh, it's so many young players; they have to learn a lot. Uh, it's important that, that they have all this experience. You can be only in the top because it's also dangerous. So it's like it's good. It's like challenge everyone here as a coaches and stuff, as a new coaches stuff and everything. So it's like a challenge for everyone. So it's a good it's a good moment to to start tomorrow and I hope we can get a two points and we give it back in the league. As, as one of the more experienced guys in the squad. Do you, do you feel a little bit of a responsibility to make sure that those younger guys are not getting too down about the results and things like that? Yes, of course, because you know it's big different complaint uh, compa uh, compared to the to the players, the young players and the and the old players. You know, we play for our families, we play for bring money and food uh, for my kids and my wife. So it's a different for sure. You for everywhere you can see is a different responsibility. You know, as, a, as experienced players. We don't play football just for fun, you know, that's, that's the main point, it's our job and we see it as a job, so all you want is always win. But this is a, this is a collective, you know, like goal, but uh, I think we are more focused on individual stuff, do your best in your position and we really play good football, I'm really happy in the way we play, so we're just a little bit unlucky, you know. And, and get managed and all this stuff, but it's part of the process. I believe in the process, and I think we are a good, you know, like a good performance in the field. You can feel the, the other teams respect you a lot, also the way we play. So uh, every game what I play, I never feel like oh, I, I have no chance to win. So it's a good, it's a good sign. And like we can just keep going, believe, and uh, of course the responsibility is going to be in the end for us, for the uh, for the majors play, you know. And, and I guess you you haven't played the role this season, it's one of the quirks of the way this sort of marked up fixture has kind of worked out, but are you, are you excited about taking on an opponent you haven't seen yet this season? Oh, sorry, sorry, what did you say? I can hear you like... Oh, yeah, you, you haven't actually played against the Raw yet this season, it's it's one of the weird things of way it's all sort of worked out fixture-wise, but are you excited to be coming up against a new opponent this weekend? Yeah, for sure, for sure, because like because of the COVID and all the stuff you play against, like against the same teams, you know, like and it's also like weird because normally you just facing one in the first lap, you're facing once and then you have a like maybe three months, two months to play against each other, but because of the COVID and all the stuff, it's kind of weird, you know, like situation where we have right now. Imagine we just played almost 12 games with the, and we don't play Brisbane, so it's the first time we play against them. So it's like really excited, you know, because it's, it's like I say, it's like a chasing you a little bit more. Like it's a different opponent, you know, like they're they're not doing well on the table like we. But if you see the way they play and like the way they fight, and it's like also it's always a difficult team to play against. So uh, A League is is for everyone. I think we still and uh, we win two win uh, two games Saturday and Wednesday, and we get back. So it's like that quick, you can change everything and, and we just forget about what happened and you just keep learning like as a lessons and, and, and believe in the process. But I, I think we're going to have the result tomorrow and I'm so excited for tomorrow and go back in the stadium. I will stay back home 10 days away, three games away, you know, like really a little bit different for us. But it is what it is and we just have to, to keep chasing. Uh, mate, I've loved watching you play. Congratulations on everything you've done for our club. Uh, how do you feel about the combinations up front? I mean, uh, it's a bit of an international melting pot up there and you've played some brilliant football yourself for Nikolai and Jason coming from Scotland and I feel like he's settled in really well. Benny Ancololo has found the back of the net, but how do you feel like uh, it's gelling in the attacking third? 
actually we have a really attacking front like you say like a little bit mix for, for everything you know, like, like different players different skills like so we can we can have like a very strong like we just need to play spend more time on the field together because like like we just play a couple of games together and we haven't training together for is for like you know uh, Benny was off after the first uh, game for four weeks and then Nicola was injury and so I have been playing with so many players around my position you know for example I play with Moraes I play with Demo I play with Nisi in my position so it's been the people doesn't see that but it's, it's difficult for you as a striker who doesn't have the, this kind of like a partner you know like always different every game is different partner so the one more consistent was Moraes and, and one moment, you know, like in the moment like we start the season before Christmas, and we really good, we play good, and we try, it, and we understand really good in the field. And, and now Jason coming to the team is new, and we still knew each other, you know, like it's like not like just magic, you know, like can be just from one day to another to be like uh, the perfect duo or something like. But I think we have a good connection in between us, Jason, me, with Nico, like experienced Nico, you know, like also Benny is coming back, you know, like in good shape and he looking fit, looking uh, quick and all this stuff. So it's good for everyone, you know, like we just we just have to be spend more time together on the field and for sure gonna, we're going to create so many good goals and many chances like we're doing already and hopefully the, 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 the result is coming to our favor.